Why do Japan's convenience stores need to be restocked three times a day? And how do they pull it off without missing a beat? In one of the world's most efficient retail systems, even a 15-minute delay can throw everything off. Today, we're unpacking the logistics machine behind Japan's Konbini, from real-time data to last-mile miracles. Let me first show you why convenience stores are the heartbeat of everyday life in Japan. Japan has over 50,000 convenience stores, known locally as Konbini. Open 24-7, these stores are an essential part of daily life. People rely on them for everything from meals and drinks to bill payments, ATM withdrawals, and printing services. Each store is small, averaging about 100 square meters, but stocks around 3,000 products. Fresh bento, sandwiches, rice balls, and seasonal items are replenished throughout the day. Because of high customer turnover and limited shelf space, these stores can't afford to overstock or run out. That's why most Kombini are restocked three times a day, once early in the morning, once mid-afternoon, and once late at night. Ever wondered how Japan's convenience stores always feel freshly stocked? Here's the secret. These frequent restocks aren't random. Deliveries are carefully scheduled in categories, refrigerated goods, frozen items, and shelf-stable products. Some stores even receive separate deliveries for newspapers and magazines. Each product category is assigned its own delivery run, and each run is timed based on when the products are likely to sell. For example, fresh bread and coffee arrive in the morning, while bentos and dinner items arrive closer to evening. This keeps the store fresh, relevant, and responsive to daily demand. Now I know you're curious, who's making sure those shelves never go empty? Behind every Konbini is a network of temperature-controlled distribution centers that serve hundreds of stores. Products arrive, get sorted into store-specific orders, and are loaded onto trucks that operate on delivery windows as short as 15 minutes. There's no time to waste. The secret? Real-time data. Every purchase feeds into a centralized system that forecasts demand, factoring in weather, holidays, and local events. It's called micro-merchandising, and it ensures each store gets exactly what it needs. No more, no less. Now, how do they manage last-mile delivery with such speed and efficiency? Let's take a look. In Japan's dense urban areas, last-mile delivery is a challenge. Streets are narrow, parking is limited, and stores are often only a few blocks apart. To handle this, delivery trucks are smaller and highly maneuverable. Routes are optimized down to the minute. Many trucks deliver to multiple stores on a single run, and store staff are trained to unload and shelve products quickly. Often in less than 10 minutes, there's no backroom storage. Everything delivered must go directly onto the shelves. But with every great system comes a cost, and Japan's isn't small. While efficient, this system puts pressure on workers and small suppliers. Truck drivers face tight delivery schedules. Factory and prep workers often work overnight to meet delivery cutoffs. And with Japan's aging population, there's a growing shortage of logistics labor. Konbini chains are now testing automation, AI-driven inventory planning, and even drone trials to future-proof the system. Most people don't think about how their sandwich gets on the shelf, but in Japan, convenience is engineered with data, precision, and nonstop delivery. Every stock shelf is a quiet success. If that blew your mind, hit like, subscribe, and tell me in the comments what surprised you most.